Γεια σας. This is the Greek Reporter Weekly News. At least 22 people were missing after a boat carrying hundreds of refugees sent out a distress signal on Sunday about 56 kilometers off the coast of the Greek island of Corfu. The Hassan Rai ship carrying at least 263 migrants has reportedly sunk near the Greek island of Corfu according to the authorities. A Dutch cargo ship rescued the passengers about seven hours after the call alerted the Coast Guard. Greece will begin proceedings against Germany at the International Court of Justice. This statement was made on Wednesday and is a bid to obtain compensation for the slaughter of hundreds of people from the town of Vistomo during World War II. Greek Prime Minister George Papandreou said he tabled the issue during a government cabinet meeting. Vistomo, located in central Greece, was the scene of a massacre in 1944. 218 people, including women and children, were executed as part of Nazi reprisals for the activity of partisans in the area. Moving on to USA now. George Venizelos is the new special agent in charge of the FBI's Philadelphia division. Before taking the top job in Philadelphia, Venizelos was for three years the FBI's second-in-command in New York. He was acting as FBI chief in New York last year during two high-profile cases, the attempted Times Square bombing and the roundup of a Russian spy ring. Venizelos is a gregarious, plain-talking North Jersey native. He graduated from Fordham University, roots for the Yankees and is a longtime Giants season ticket holder. Venizelos' personal history includes a father who was a Greek port captain and immigrated in the 1940s. His mother was born in Lowell, Massachusetts to Greek parents who had emigrated decades earlier. On to Hollywood now. Slamdance has announced the 2011 feature competition slate for the 17th annual Slamdance Film Festival taking place January 21st through the 27th this year in Park City, Utah. Among the 10 narrative and 8 documentary feature films is Last Fast Ride, directed by Greek-American filmmaker Lili Skurtis. Last Fast Ride is a documentary film about punk rock performer Marian Anderson, lead singer of the notorious Bay Area punk rock band The Insanes, who died too young. On to Australia. Federal Minister for School Education Peter Garrett has shown his government's continued commitment to language education in Australia schools. He declared that Greek is one of Australia's major community languages, a reflection of the significant contributions for the Greek-Australian community has made to the cultural and social development of Australia. In recent correspondence with the Australian Hellenic Council, Liberal MP for Flinders in Victoria, Greg Hunt confirmed his representations to Mr. Garrett about the inclusion of modern Greek in the Australian curriculum. A spokesperson for the AHC of New South Wales said languages education is one of the most important issues for the community. The AHC awaits the release of the shaping paper for languages as well as confirmation of the inclusion of the Hellenic language in the new national education system. And some interesting news from France. Greek-French actor Denis Podalidis stars as Nicolas Sarkozy in the French film La Conquête, The Conquest. The film covers the five years in the run-up to Nicolas Sarkozy's election in 2007 and his split with his then-wife Cecilia. Podalidis said, I'm playing Sarkozy, the least I can do is not judge him and above all not caricature him. My role will be to make him human, give him depth, play on his contradictions. When the French president was informed about the movie cast, he stated, This is not fair. Denis Podalidis has less hair than me. Filmmaker and director Xavier Duringer has gone to extreme lengths to ensure accuracy, yet the film may be extremely embarrassing for Sarkozy. Thank you for watching. For more news and updates, visit us at GreekReporter.com. And remember, Greeks are everywhere.